Counting jaguars is hard enough in good times. Sure, they're the biggest cats in the Americas, but they're silent, they're secretive, and they can disappear in dense forest. Still, the scientists with Panthera, that's the Global Wildcat Conservation Organization, have gotten really good at it. Their work and camera traps in Belize at the Coxcomb Basin Wildlife Sanctuary have kept tabs on more than 100 jaguars, not to mention other animals, cougars, and white-lipped peccaries among them. There's so much to the story of jaguars here that researcher Bart Harmson has even made a soap opera out of the life of one handsome bruiser. Welcome back to another story of Ben the Jaguar. Previous stories concentrated on the male rivalry between Ben and his main nemesis, M117. And Bart has closely watched a female. She's probably mated with Ben. And the result? These two tiny cubs. But in August, there was trouble in this paradise for jaguars when it caught a direct hit from Hurricane Earl. As soon as they could, the Panthera team rushed back into the jungle to check cameras and search for signs of the cats. Now the counting was more important than ever. Who had survived? Ben, the cat who was always such a regular for the cameras, appeared once, but then vanished. After weeks of worried tracking, Bart saw two jaguars on the trail, a rare face-to-face -face sighting. It was Ben, alive and well, and keeping company with a female. And more good news. We know that mother jaguar and at least one cub have survived. There's still hope the second is alive, too. Somewhere just outside that camera frame. So, the counting continues. <laughs> 